hey guys in today's video i'll show you how to apply a cc radial fast blur in after effects so without much further to do let's get started so right here in my composition i already have everything set up i already have the layer in which i'll be adding the cc uh, radial fast blur in, in it which is mostly a uh, shape layers in after effect and then i also have my background layer right here which i added as a solid uh, as a solid shape just to right click go to new and solid after doing that the first thing is that i'll be adding a cc razor fast blow and to do that i'll select this layer right here it's effects and then under the effects you have to blur and sharpen with the blur and sharpen you can just come down here and you see the razor fast blow you click on it you just add it so you see as you click on it it gives it the default value and the default value right here is 50 but i'll be changing this amount to something around 85 so one thing you've noticed is that you know see this main part here is also blurred out which we don't want that we want this to be in focus and sharpened out so to do that you just have to come to this zoom right here and change the value to brightest so after doing that you can now see that everything is now sharpened out and it's now in focus uh, so after applying this effect to make it more interesting you can add in more color to it and to add more color i'll be using the gradient fill and to add a gradient fill i'll be using the gradient ram and to do that i'll select the layer in which i want to add the gradient ram and go to effect and then come down to generate to generate you see the gradient ram here you click on it and for this you see that it has two values which is the start and the end color so for the start color it always the default is always black and the end is always white so i'm just going to select the start color right here and assign something green to it you just say right here and you hit ok the next will be the end we apply something yellow not too yellow and not too green something in between somewhere around here yeah this is just fine and you can see i can adjust these handles right here move up and then here you can just adjust it depending on what kind of effect you want you want it to look like so after doing that it now gives in more details to it the next thing is that i'm animating the center of the cc radial fast blur and to do that i'll be using an object you can use any object you can even use a picture or a video depending on what you want for this tutorial i'll be using the object the object i'll be using is a circle right here which i'll just select the color so it's set to white and i'll draw at the center of my composition holding control and shift you have a perfect shape then i hold control and double click on the pan behind tool to put the anchor point at the center and center this up so i'm just going to drag this down beneath the shape layer right here i'm just going to level it circle so with this, I'm just going to press P for the position tool, hold out and click on this stopwatch icon here to open the expression window. And I'm going to type in wiggle. So for the wiggle, I'm going to set in a value of 1, 500, which is the frequency and the amplitude perspective. So the wiggle effect just makes the position of this circle to move randomly around the composition, which will be very fine because the next thing is that i'll pick with the center of that cc radial fast blur to the position of this circle so when the circle moves the center of this um, which is center right here also moves so to do that i'm going to come down here to effects and then cc radial fast blur and then for the center right here i'm just going to pick with this to the position so the blur also moves as the circle moves that's it for today's video guys hope you learned something new today relating to motion graphics please do support the channel by liking the video and subscribing to the channel so that it encourages me to drop out new uh, tutorials just like this every week thanks for watching the video see you in the next one and peace out